So what is a simulation theory? What is that hypothesis? It's probably became most famous after Nick Bostrom published his paper on the topic, are you living in a computer simulation? What are the chances? What are the odds? If you listen to some philosophers, Nick Bostrom is one example, but there are others. It's very likely, if not certain, that we are in a computer simulation. Most other people don't have such high probabilities for it. I personally think it's almost a certainty, retroactive placement. This is either the stupidest idea or the most brilliant one you'll ever hear. <laughs> one day, we're going to have technology to make virtual reality. Virtual reality is so good, you can't really tell if it's virtual or real. And we can modify your brain a little so you forget that you entered virtual reality. It's affordable, it's available. What I'm going to do, and I pre-commit to it right now, I will simulate this exact moment billions of times, retroactively placing you into a computer simulation. Are you real, or are you just one of the simulations attending the stock? You want to know the difference, right? It simulates your brain, your consciousness states, everything about this moment, including previous history of you getting to this festival and so on. This should greatly increase your probability of being in a simulation. In fact, if I run even more simulations, I can get you to 100. But for some reason...